Uh, my boyfriend won't stop watching TikTok, so I will just start instead. <laughs> this is called Dancers Vomit to Street Woman Fighter. Really? This wait, enough wait, for you? Wait, you really want Before we start, disclaimers first. This is just our opinions as street dancers, okay? So, yes, just want to put it out there. Yep, so anyway, like. There's a lot of people talking about the whole Rosalie Lip J thing and then maybe talks about the whole Rihe Honey J thing but let's just say Rihe and Honey J thing sort of resolve a bit more peacefully although from my understanding I still don't think they fully resolve their differences but at least on the show wise it looked like it was pretty resolved there were a lot of cheers all around and stuff and if you contrast it to Rosalie Lip J people are not crying tears of joy after their yeah. battle lah yeah people are not crying tears of that it was dead silence like if you do realize that like, everybody was quiet there was no cheering other than for want i know the whole sticker thing like what no disrespect you have to call out yeah there, there was no choice like, i guess we emphasized too much on it on the previous video don't take too much at face value um we, uh maybe this is our opinion this, our opinion, this is what we yeah. evaluate from what we see from yeah. the show okay Just but if you like you can have your opinion like we respect it yeah. it's fine yeah so anyway yeah so anyway moving on move anyway, on to the show to, to be fair, this, epi this episode is quite mild. The, the whole judging criteria has been very inconsistent throughout the show. So how do you choose a main dancer? Honestly, usually the main choreographer is the main dancer. Uh, for me, main dancer should be picked on the best performance value because you have to be the one with all the attention on you. Um, best performance value can mean your own personal style and whatever. So when they chose Nose for her clean execution, I thought, okay, main dancer criteria is chosen by clean execution. Hmm. Then Samis made a mistake and they chose the Hilly, I cannot pronounce it, Hilly, um, who wasn't really like clean execution, but had the most attitude and had the most of her own style. Yep. And then by the Lip J and Rian one, uh, why didn't they choose Lip J? Yeah, why did they choose Lip J, right? Like, but you, I know why they didn't choose but Lip J. But Rian really did very well. So you you can you, it's like the uh, 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 like react like the uh, 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 like react expression we could express the choreography well even though she I she hit it harder like, hit than harder than than so, so there's execution as well as performance right. finally to the pairs class or the sub class I cannot remember okay which they chose the want team and I can totally understand how they choose the want team but the reason that they give right is very inconsistent like, we choose once because of their personal style. You haven't been chosen on personal style for the past three selections, eh? And Inconsistent. Yeah, then from the leaders class, shouldn't you have chosen someone like Lee Jong or Honey J, whom, I've, as I said, you cover, you know it's Lee Jong dancing, yep. you know it's Honey J dancing. They have a very, very, very strong personal yep. style, but very inconsistent, no? Which, um, actually, as Sam pointed out to me just now, inconsistent judging has always been the bane of dance, dance competitions. So it's quite human to have a criteria, but don't stick to it. But as audience, it's very irritating. I'm gonna call it out. But we're just gonna take it because inconsistent judging is always there. Like going to the video itself. So what do you think? What was your favorite choreography from a dancer point of view? Yeah, I think for this challenge, they are really putting the dancer's choreography as well as visualization skills to the test. So. That's how I chose my favorite, and I chose Rian Zhuan because she totally changed Lip J's choreography to suit herself. Sly, but I guess you have to do it. I think it's very necessary. Number two, Rian Zhuan looked like an MV to me, like a real production. The others were like dance video, but Rian's was like a music video with a very strong concept, and the arrangement just felt so organic. Okay, so from a videographer point of view, I also think Rian's video is the best out of them all. I would say a close second might be the the, the pretty savage one. That's a that's my close second. Oh, that one thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, the pretty savage one is my close second. But the other ones too. It really looked more polished. Polished. A lot more polished. Yeah. Like a professional work. Yeah. All know Miss Haley has given a lot of things to everybody else to do. Even the directing, we know it was done by Monica la. So thankfully. She is able to count on her yep. teammates, so I wouldn't give her a lot of choreographer or like you know high visualization points. You know like, huh? You're not a very good director, and mm, I mean, she, you can she, still learn. Be, she's very to, young. To be fair, she was quite honest about it, so I guess that's that lah. You know, she was honest about it. Yeah, but uh, sometimes people will take it as a 
as a witness. Yeah. Uh, this is a show. Uh. And a then show. Like, you thought, right, I have no idea what I'm doing. Could you help me, please? And then she means it's like, <laughs> just give me main dancer la, what the pairs, we talk about the pairs first, we talk about the leaders. But the pairs was a bit too messy and uh, there's But too I think it's not, their it's not their fault. It's not their fault. It's very big, the space, yeah. and then it's like... <laughs> there, were, there were way too many people. And they're so, no, their space so far apart. Their space, their so, space far. so far apart, so I don't feel the collective energy of yeah. all of them coming yeah, at me. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't really feeling that video la. like, I can but I, I love the close-ups though. Yeah. I love the, the close-ups. Close yeah. That's when I felt something. That's why whatever Taeyong said that, they're like, oh, I can only see the YG dancer sometimes. When I watch the video, I think it, no, I'm sorry, I cannot. I cannot see the YG dancer. I, I don't know. Are they looking at a second cut or like? What are you looking what at? What are you looking at? Like That's, what? Direct? It's here. It's like, eh. here. Here. Small things, eh. So small things. Even the original video, I watched. I was thinking like. I what? can't even see any one of them anyway until the close up. So I also like I'm pre if there's a director's cut, please send it to us. Oh, like everybody's picking on YGX, y'all. This is a show, ah, uh, and then also Karma is Karma, uh, Y'all don't know what YGX did, right? I, YGX put one at the back of the yeah. class, ah, uh, when they are teaching the choreography. Okay, so cattiness begets cattiness. It's a it's, it's a, a whole, it's, it's a, a fair game, okay? It's a petty show, though. Just take just. It's uh, a petty show. They are allowed to do petty things, so they will do it. They don't want to get eliminated, right? And come the leaders one. This Finally, I, I think the leaders one is just for me. It's just a bit of a disappointment. I and I'll tell you why. Go for it. Okay. So right, I feel like Noze is a very good choreographer, but I feel that Noze can improve in terms of her visualization. We all know that Noze took a very long time to do a very simple front back blocking change, do si do, <laughs> and walk across the stage. Or very strong characters around her that like, like waiting to be placed as chess pieces. They're yeah. just staring at her like I'm gonna eat y'all up. Like like, like you have So some... where are you gonna put me? Yeah so you, it's so hard, hard to gonna see Nose like like I mean she does very well but you're not gonna look at her. You're gonna end up looking at Gabby, you're gonna end up looking at like Lee Jo, you're gonna end up looking at Monica because there were so many good like And then I think that during the show they said it very well themselves. She put like a very huge blocking right and she spread them out. So your eyes are going everywhere yeah. but the center it's about thinking about the shape that you want yeah. and I feel like she can still improve on that and I tell you for people like Hyojin Choi and Gabby who for them right choreography is like bam bam arrange tum 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 I have 20 uh, hours to get this K-pop dance choreography to Chonghua I got no time boom 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 like this right they see Noze like down there like uh, from that 30 minutes you can understand at the well, end of a hard day yeah. they are a dancer point of view, uh, if you when you do take part in productions, right, then you have a choreographer and them slow. Uh, it gets it's slow and bad. indecisive. It's super frustrating. You're right? standing there and doing nothing. You're doing nothing. And, and it's not like... It's, it's very mentally draining. All day, huh? They have spent the whole day auditioning, dancing their lungs out, mm. dancing so many times, I don't know how many times they have to re-record the auditions. Also anyway, like for the leader side, for, as a video choreographer, the, the, the video was a bit shit. Like. <gasps> to me, to me <gasps> the filming was a bit... Oh, the filming. The filming was a bit shit lah, so, so which was why I feel like it's a bit of a disappointment because I would think like... They tried too much. No, they tried too little. It's like, huh? it's like there's nothing special about those movements or whatnot other than the fireworks. And even then the fireworks so was, the fireworks was, was like, so, so extra for no So reason. extra and it wasn't even done correctly. Because usually when people do fireworks, it's like there's a there's a huge distance and then you comp you use a very long lens, you compress so that you, you so can... It's the, it doesn't look like white angle. It's like... What, like basically like, when the thing explodes, right? You know how small the dancers get yeah. when they zoom out? They become like this, eh? Yeah. You don't want this. I don't want to be so small at the end of the dance. You know, I want to be this. I want you to zoom into my face. I want like, everything to explode behind me. I want yeah, you to see like, me. You, like you just need to look some Power Rangers reference like how they fireworks behind then the, the Power Rangers pose up. It's very cool but in their case it's like some small GoPro at the side then it's like a bit low effort but it's strong too many strong players inside the too many cooks spoil the broth kind of thing everybody dancing their own style not very clean that kind of thing oh, you really yeah I mean I, I, I still the tea yes. so what do you think Noze could have done you want her to take out a wig and whip all of them yeah. can y'all do properly can you do exactly the way that I want you to you think she can whip them that's why I cannot uh, that's why then this is the whole Korean hierarchy thing so you can't really do anything so that's why I say life is hard for Mose uh? I like life it's very hard, hard uh? for Mose so boss dancer then no need to para pose yo Look me straight in the eye. Look me straight in the eye and say it. <laughs> you're all dead. You're all dead. I'll battle whoever and whichever anybody of you at this time. You are all dead. 
Give me a hug, give me a hug, give me a hug. No, check, I just any hug, but you can see, I just, I love that moment. He panicked, you'll be like, he, he, there was panic. There was panic in, in was Daniel's like, eyes. Monica, she, so, who is that? <laughs> yeah, I love the happy. I, I, my, my favorite part for this is the whole. So, so, so who, who do you believe in, Lord or the Buddha? I believe in Monica. <laughs> I also believe in the Church of Monica. <laughs> it's time for the battles. Bow, 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 bow. Round one YGX. Versus. Hook. <laughs> See, I suddenly forget. Sorry. Okay. This Yo, is okay. a hook redemption arc. We love it. So, yes, YGX came out with their. Um, some, some maybe pre-planned routines and we know these are like maybe they have some routines at the back of their mind like, yeah. they are not totally like free-forming and freestyling yeah so Hook did a really good job I think it was fresh it was fresh versus Crump I mean all the girl dancers all the female dancers there are very tired of seeing feminine style like. I mean it's very predictable mm. I'm sorry to say so when they see two girls who then let's just say they haven't had a lot of airtime yet like truly yeah no expectation, just come out unintimidated. Kill it. Kill it with technique and style. Everybody got a bit blown away. Like there's a, there's a bit of strategy. A bit of strategy involved. People like, are threatened by YG, YGX. But it's, a it's a fact. They are a strong team. Battle 2. Um, this is... The Cheyon one. We are very sad. I think we are genuinely quite sad to see her getting... I think the saddest line that I heard from her was like, I don't want to dance anymore. Oh, yeah, that girl, was, that broke my heart. No, that, that a bit broke my heart. Like, and then we'll go back to episode 1, like, whoever they told you to take part to this show, I should get fired. Like, I don't think it girl, was... Girl, that was... We were not ready. It was so like, obvious that she was being thrown to the wolves. Uh, uh, she's not ready for battling. Yeah. She's ready to choreo. She's ready to execute and kill choreography. Sure. It was really throwing to the, to the lions, to the wolves or whatever. It's, it's not and, a good look. Right? Yeah, and it's like someone told her, you only need to battle like two times. It's okay, you don't have experience, it's fine. No, she's been battling. It's like the, her fifth, sixth time already. She just keeps going and losing. Yeah. We must comment Cheon that she has picked up a lot of battle tactics in the show. Yeah. She <laughs> has used number one, the hype tactic. Yeah. Oh! She used the height tactic. Oh, Number two, see, see. she has also used the covering your opponent tactic. Yeah. Cheon has learned well, <laughs> and she's learning, but it's just unfortunate the hook girl was too good. <laughs> Yun Kyung. Okay, so Yun first of all, so how do you like? How do you judge battle, right? So number one, your level of technique displayed. The level of mastery that you show for your genre. That's how I would choose because this is in the space of an all-style battle. Mm. Yeah, so they will choose based on how high your level is. Yun Kyung showed very strong light feet, is it? Whatever. This Harlem Shake, right? Mm. Her Harlem Shake is special, eh? Her Harlem Shake is a Yun Kyung Harlem Shake, eh? I never seen before. Yeah, that's quite you nice. can see, eh? All of them are screaming at the Harlem Shake, eh? A single Harlem Shake. And then also, like, her facial expression and then her, her, her isolation, it's so high level. Yeah. But for Cheon, right? She's displaying. Uh, a style that is like I'm enjoying the music yeah. la 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 which, which is fine, fine. Which is it's fine. fine like the technique is good mm. but it is like a bit more lower level like a bit more foundation the person is dancing to win and one person is dancing not to lose different mindset they are improving like I, you, even you see from that, that whatever music video thing it's good like Cheon is good like on screen Cheon is so good but yeah but it's a different ball game when it's battling. Right? So, yeah, so yeah. you see, you can see from all the dancers there what, what they value is about the same as us. Mm. The level of technique displayed, which truly uh, Yoon Kyung took it. She came, she woke up, and she showed herself. She, cho she chose violence. She chose violence that she day. She just wanted to win. It was very obvious, right? She just wanted to win. But anyway. And I feel very sad um, that she has to choose Cheon, but in reality, you, want, you don't want your team to lose. Mm. You really don't want your team to lose. Oof. Battle 3, Oof, Jane yeah. versus Lee Su. I feel like leaving that one for last, but alright, let's go. <laughs> this is the highlight for me. <laughs> this was this is highlight. like finally I'm cringing. I feel attacked. Like, I feel attacked. I feel like my story is being told. <laughs> okay, let's just put it out there. Jane is okay. Jane, Jane is fine. Like, Jane even says it herself. She didn't, did, she didn't. I could have done better. There's just a way that Lee Su just totally went off the beat, <laughs> off the beaten path, onto into Mars, into outer space. That make you. There's just no way that Lee Su can win in this battle. It, that's why I will explain that we feel attacked. Right? It's because yeah. every dancer that take a part battle right, will have made that one mistake. If you're very desperate, you're very desperate, right? You'll do anything to you'll win, do right? Anything to you'll do you do things that you take risks. 
and you do things that you, you cannot do, yeah. your body is like, I am not ready. Yeah. But your no. mind is like, do it now! No. Your brain says that, oh, you this move is very nice, right? But actually, your body isn't trained it's not to ready. do that move. Term that a lot of people say, you're like eaten up by and the music. music. Yeah. You're, you're, too, you're too eaten up by the music that you're not in control. And I think the music carry you and then you just lose all control. And this was all what? control. Lost. There's nothing, actually, right? Jane just needs to stand at the side right, and do this. And, and just do like this and do this. I think she's been already. For me. <laughs> yeah. you, you lost, basically, you, uh, 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 you she really lost, lost, control. Control. lost control. She really lost control. It, it ha- and it happens, it happens. I'm not, I'm not gonna say she's shit, it's just that even, even me, even you, anyone that she does will have this happen yeah. to you. Last battle of the day, our queen's battle, Miss Monica Shane is just a respectable woman. She's like, I don't play games, I don't play this strategy shit, I don't choose people to just, you know, win them and, and smash them down. I choose people who are on the same level as me. And then like she feels comfortable with it. I mean they're friends for so long already. So if I lose to this person, if I win this person, I'm okay with it. Yep. Actually I prefer that. Yeah. Actually you know what? That's better. Imagine if she chose somebody that she was supposed to win, but she didn't win. That the the, the disgrace. Yep. The it's more. So I think whatever that her choice right is really good for her reputation. Yep. Eh? What's your preferred winner? I would prefer Honey to win. La. Honey J to win, yeah. So that's that. But just yeah. feel that Honey J is just closer with the music. What we see on TV, la, I don't know. I need to see the uncut version, but I connect yeah, the, more. The final results was quite close anyway, so. I connected more to Honey J's. La. But you know what? Battle is subjective. You can have your opinion, I can have my opinion, and it's fine. Uh, okay. You should wrap it up. Anyway, thank you for watching this episode 3, a very mild one. Unfortunately, give me that drama. Yeah, I guess I didn't want to eat myself. Church of Monica. <laughs> um, thank you guys so much for watching our episode 3 kind of reaction opinions to Street Human Fighter. Uh, if you want to see us react to episode 4, please comment down below because we are trying to make this a weekly thing. Once again, we are very happy that Mnet has a street dance show that is trying to show more of street dance in general. Battles are subjective. You can like somebody, I can like somebody. And that is fine okay and it's also a tv show whatever they want to show you the story is manufactured in the way it may not represent real life it's a show it's a drama you enjoy the drama but then that's it don't leave hate to anybody don't give me hate i'm sorry give constructive comments give like proper questions and don't just send hate below because just that because you don't agree with us and, or you try to justify that the judges are right. Let's just say if the judges are right, there wouldn't be so much bad reactions or whatever in this. <laughs> yeah, so anyway, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed our video. Um, I actually do lots of K-pop dance tutorials. It's all over on my channel. And you can actually request for the K-pop dance tutorial that you want all over on my Patreon in the description below. Okay, thank you so much to my patrons. You're really... Keep my channel going. Alright, uh, if you want to follow me on social media, it is at Carissa Hu on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. Uh, you can watch some of his videos, a lot of wacky videos on LipJ on RP Productions YouTube page. They've been churning a lot, out a lot of K-pop content nowadays. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Please like and subscribe. If you, wanna, if you want us to continue doing this, turn on the notification bell to know when I post a new video. I hope you guys are staying safe wherever you are. Um, hope you are <laughs> have it. Hope you guys are having a great day and I love you all who bays. You really